Hey guys, um, Sean Lanner's back here. Um, right now we're doing a canon review of Star Wars Lego Star Wars canon. Yeah. Um, so, um, it's we have the canon. It's an anti-aerial canon. Okay, so we have the canon here. Um, as always, we're gonna review the set last. set last. Figures first. The figures first. So... First, we're going to dive into the Jedi. So, the Jedi here is Plo Koon. Um, the head sculpt is pretty good. He has his little prong fang things here. Respirator. Respirator. No peg on the on the top. Um, very nice head sculpt. It captures Plo Koon's image. Yeah, his head mold is magnificent. Nice head mold, yeah. Yeah, it's a mold, not a sculpt. Okay, I just remember that. Then, he has nice robe. I had to take off the head because the prongs will get in the way. Prongs, yeah. Okay. Um, he has gloves. Nice um, belt, I guess. He has his belt that goes all the way around and then just the back of his robe. Yeah. He gets the standard Star Wars lightsaber Star Wars. hilt. It's just a gray hilt. Just a original gray hilt He's with a with a, the blue collar saber. This one red. Are you gonna give this one ratings later? Yeah, sure. Okay. So like for adults, children, and small children. Okay. Okay. Um, this is a wolf pack trooper. Yes, wolf pack. Yeah, you got it. Um, his helmet. They have helmets. Very nice helmet detail, like, just like, the print, print, the print is awesome, I just, wow, it's very clone trooper-esque, it's all white, and he has, now he has, he comes with the original Clone Wars, Clone Wars head. head. Well, it's not and original, it's not 1999 original, but it's, um, the original 2010, they actually brought it back yeah. in 2014, because, 2013 and 2014 because of the Yoda Chronicles, and also they brought it back because, well, 2014 was right when the series ended, and Wolfpack were in the last season, and Wolfpack were huge in the last okay. season. So, unlike other clone troopers, they have gray arms, um, and a... Partially gray back and top torso, and then their legs gray. Nice printing, and the head has a little peg thing, unlike Plo Koon. The weapon, um, I would review this guy, but they're exactly identical. Now I'm gonna review the gun. Alright, it's just a, a normal blaster with the with the uh, scope and you put it in his hand in his hand I got him on. there you go put the lightsaber in Plo's hand too okay now we have a droid unlike the other reviews this one is a droid a droid de ka a droid de ka the ones that roll up into the balls a droid de ka I so, okay, the so they have these little pegs here that you open up so it can stand. Has these eyes here that are like the switches. Those aren't eyes, those are actually like, she like the shield generators. Like okay, I'm sorry, the shield generators. A little they help, peg here. Actually, they help with the shields, the little triangles. Oh, okay, in the back here the are the. Generators. The blasters, um, very, I think they got the colors right, nice textures, that's the, <laughs> that's the, uh, head, goes, this is very, off centered, um, head goes all the way up, after this we might end up back. doing Halo, Megabon, yes we will, after yeah. all the Star Wars, yes, and it goes down that far, Halo's later, right? Okay? Okay. Now we have the actual set. This is this anti sky cannon thing. So, first, before we get into any details, let's go through the features. Okay, right here you have a little, little um, gear here, but when you twist it, these, if you twist it counterclockwise, it goes down. 
Clockwise. Or, counterclockwise. or this is counterclockwise. That's clockwise. clockwise. Makes it go down. Counterclockwise makes, makes it go, it go up. up. So it's like That's aiming. Strong. You see, and this is the. So, um, the legs move. They move all the way in and all the way out to about there. Okay. Oh no, not a bad set. Yes. These spin. Here, let me. It spins right here. These spin. These spin. It has a flick missile right here that you just. You don't want to play with Jar Jar? Flick. Or press. Out. You can put it right back in. For you. Alright. Right here, uh, I have the seat, a white top. and then you have like a little control panel there. Oh, no, he doesn't have one. You have all these okay, give me here and I can red. Oh, Sorry, Shoot. you have all these red tubings. Then you actually get a spring loading missile here, there you go. which you just tap the, and it shoots. The tubes get in the way though. Yes. Like majorly. Like when you first build it, it's fine, but once the tubes get a little yeah, like broken in, it's like. Tap really it bad. and it shoots. Tap it in. Just tap it. Just give it a little tap. And a little click. Okay. Now let's look at the bottom of this. There's nothing much going on. Nothing with the much here. Just a clear um, brick piece. Just a, yeah, just a clear brick piece. There's these, these two moves. wheels. Um, those are. For mobility, like I think there's a way where if you put it in a certain position, it, it could roll on those wheels like a little hover car thing. I've just been too lazy to actually figure out how to do it. So these little feet here, they also spin With, because their pieces don't have much friction at all. Yes, and um, yeah, just a very bland colors. Like gray and just few red pieces and yellow pieces, but other than that, it's kind of a boring color, which suits it, cause it's a cannon. You don't want a really colorful cannon, you know. <laughs> Neon um, green. I say so, we should glow in the dark. Neon green. On the side here, they there's four miss more missiles, extra missiles, or for flicking. Uh, you got two on that side and two on the, two other, on side. the other side. So um. For these, for the next upcoming videos, I'm gonna give them ratings. This um, one, coolness, probably give it uh, probably a uh, how would seven point six. For, how would you rate it for children? For okay, for age Young wise, children. I would say probably uh, teenagers, because this is kind of um, it's kind of no, hard no. to build. Like, Josh told me it was no, hard to it build. Was, it was easier, uh, but that's oh, okay. because I'm experienced. But yeah. like Sean, what I mean by the rating scale is like for young adult or for children, like small children. Yeah, I play with this. I'd give it maybe a six, not even a six, maybe like a four. I would say because, I would um, say rating for me it would be yeah, about yeah. a six and a, a seven point five. Oh. Um, but for for kids. Small it's children. not good for small children small because children because there's not many bright colors. Like I'd say about and, four for small children. And choking hazards. Oh heck yeah, choking hazards. And hazard. um, it's uh, kind of just bl too bland. There's not many. Too bland, colors. not many colors, and who knows what they know. So, um, <laughs> so oh, that's the for young adults that are teenagers. I'd probably give this a seven because I want to say seven because. They're more into collecting, and adults, I'd probably give it a 7 as well. Because okay, so that's the end of this video. Like the orbital, is that an orbital cannon? No, it's a AV-7 anti-aerial anti okay. cannon. Okay, so that's the end of this 